So actually, we can repeat this top view, front view, and side view with another three-dimensional object. For example, this three-dimensional object consists of four cubes. Four cubes. So let's look at the front view first. So this is the front view. It will be just two squares because there are two more squares which are behind. behind. So what about the top view? Top view will be this angle. Again, we have only two squares, two squares. So this is front view, this is top view. And finally, the side view will be looking from the side. So this is the side view. We have one, two, three, four, four squares. But of course, in this textbook, the side view is, is referring just to one of the side. We will not consider this as the right hand side or the left hand side, just the side view. And, because, and now we go back to the original angle. 